Hey guys, this is Mihei and this is Hailey and welcome to Toku TV. So the drama search WWW finished recently, mm -hmm. which means it's time for a full review on the drama. And what we can say for sure that this drama was the best drama for the first half of this year. Yep. I know we kind of gave it all out already, mm -hmm. but we're gonna go into a bit more detail and talk about why we liked it so much and also what we thought could have been a bit better. Mm -hmm. I really like this drama, mm -hmm. but if I had to choose just one point, yeah. the disappointing point, it would be Tang Gi Yong's acting because mm. it felt a bit stiff. Yeah. Yeah. You remember the scene when he cried after his mom died? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I didn't not didn't like it, but a yeah. bit awkward. But I think it was just because the other actors were so good. Oh yeah. And Tommy's character was mm. for me a bit frustrating because she. she couldn't make up her mind quickly. I actually liked Tommy's character because I could relate to her so much. Mm. Like this is kind of a side note, but <laughs> <laughs> I also tend to think more about the future when starting a relationship. Mm. So you know that's why I have a hard time to actually start one. Oh. But, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I totally understood her, mm. you know, feelings and dilemmas that yeah. she had. I see. First of all, the actors. <sighs> <laughs> Every single one of them was so adorable and I really didn't know that Idai was that cute and I like how every character had their own charm and their personality mm, Yeah, like Jonhaejin, oh, Jonhaejin's oh. acting was crazy good as well like her charisma was unbelievable and Yesujong I didn't see her previous works, but like, wow. Oh. She was so sophisticated and she was supposedly the evil character, mm -hmm. but I could not hate her. And what I really liked was that the message mm -hmm. the writer wanted to send was very clear. She also included some controversial topics that are going on in Korea mm -hmm. and gave us some points to think about, like marriage, you know, mm -hmm. trending keywords, government censorship on individuals, and etc. And even the drama, inside the drama, uh -huh. the Seol Ji Hwan is staring yeah. in what, what was the name? Jang Woon Nim Jang Woon Nim, 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 Nim. <laughs> That drama, I really like it <laughs> I want to see more, really Despite having like all these different stories, mm -hmm. three different couples it wasn't hard to follow at all like they all had their own full story talking about the storyline the lines in the drama was so good so i wrote some of them in my note i know they were so good i yeah. think it was even better because they had characters from all these different ages like mm. ellie ellie yeah oh. i felt like she represented us like people 20s. in their 20s yeah. living in Korea and then they have Tommy, Chaehyun and Kagyong in their mm -hmm. 30s like Brian 40-50 and then President Chang in her 60s or 70s who mm -hmm. knows but anyway <laughs> it was nice to see that they represented a wide range of people yeah and the writer was Kim Eun Suk's assistant writer before and oh. this was her first work so that's why we could see some similar oh, yeah. story yeah like the style was a bit similar yeah yeah yeah, yeah. but I think it was better because mm -hmm. it was combined with some current trends so it created greater synergy I think mm. Oh, and we cannot take this out. The soundtracks. <gasps> uh. As soon as Ojun's Milky Way Between Us came out, what was that? The 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 note like the unique angle right, shot right. <laughs> and the color scheme yeah like close ups oh and... it just went so well with the whole bottle oh, drama oh my goodness the scene where um they showed Tammy and morgan after they broke up oh i thought i was watching some mm. music video mm. and i had nothing against it and lastly we have to talk about how it showed a strong independent mm. woman by having three <laughs> female leads it definitely was refreshing like this drama in korea right but it did feel like it was a bit intentional. Uh, yeah, the characters and high positions were mm -hmm. all females, and the ending, uh, the ending especially, <laughs> it just felt like 
yes, this is the girl power, mm -hmm. you know? But I mean, I love the ending, mm -hmm. don't get me wrong. But still, it was still nice to see these changes in K-drama. Like, the male leads were usually highlighted and they used informal language to female characters and the female characters would yeah. use formal language to the male characters. Yeah, but true, true. here, Tommy used informal while Morgan used formal language to Tommy. So, yeah, I do hope we see more of these in upcoming K-dramas. Mm -hmm. All in all, this was the best drama in 2019 so far. Mm -hmm. I think I would even put it in my top 10 K-drama list. Too. Yeah, me too. I really love this drama and I really recommend this to you. Please, please watch it. <laughs> please, yes. And we'll come back next week with another video. Yeah, so watch K-drama. And banger with Taku TV. Bye! Bye. Bye. <laughs> 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 <laughs>